Yeah, 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 welcome back. Where, 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 I was gonna ask you, where, what were we doing? Where are we? Oh, we're in the fireplace. We're in the hot zone. We, we got a cool guy on our team now. Right, yes, I remember Axel. We were How could I forget in love. Axel? We were falling in love with Axel, slowly but surely. We have a ton of energy tanks. And... And we, you have the, the, the need to heal. I, I wanna get, I wanna get those two little weak ones up. Oh, no, wait, she's maxed out, she's maxed out, you're maxed out. Okay, well, whatever. I just wanna give, give our boy a little bit. To work okay. With. And X as well, or...? Uh, X is, X is, yeah, he could use a, he could use a little top off. A little May bit. as well. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, our okay. boy was super sick because he could turn into all the bosses. Yeah, I remember that. And do a bunch of cool shit. As long as we beat him. And we, and we were, we, we never... Almost like some sort of Mega Man. Almost like some sort of Mega Man. Fuck you, all you other Mega Men, you don't get that power in this game. And, uh, Axel's the Mega Man. And Cinnamon, we never brought out. Because yeah. Because we were waiting for her yeah. to be of age. So we still need to get the... Uh, yes, of age, yeah. Uh, we still need to get the ball and chain or whatever the fuck it was for that robot, That is remember? a robot that was lying around, yes, that's if we true. If we find that at some point. Okay, we have some That's a nothing. It's a conveyor belt. That's also a nothing. That's a battle. Yep. I, th I think it's a hint in towards... Uh, wow, that's a that's a stronger enemy group than we've seen so far in this. Yeah, area. actually, we fought we fought those yellow devil clone type things individually. Alone, and well, plus that thing in the middle alone. You know what we forgot to do? What? Hold on a second. What? <laughs> Here's what we forgot to do. Uh, I'm gonna hit run. record on the video. No, I no, we're recording. <laughs> what we forgot to do is uh, go back to base, uh, put on all our equipment that we wanted to deal. Um, oh, was that what it was? We wanted fire resistance. We wanted oh god, this is trash. <laughs> a bunch, and we wanted uh, to get the counter to fire, uh, which is thunder. Is it? Yes. Okay, it is. Thunder, thunder beats fire. Okay. Uh, fire beats uh, wa. Uh, fire beats. Wa you can do no, it. No, no, no. Thunder beats shit. Thunder fire beats fu water. Water beats fire. Fu fire beats thunder. I think. There you go. That's correct. Yes. I think that's what it is. Yes. Electricity conducts across water. Water. Don't do this to yourself because it's gonna fall apart. In water like, outs the fa the flames. It's, it's gonna fall apart right now. And the flames do fucking nothing to, to the, the thunder. <laughs> they do like nothing. They do absolutely nothing. Oh it's god. It's bullshit. It's really dumb. Don't let games teach you that, kids. Yeah. It doesn't work. And in fact, wasting the heal there when we could have just done this. And, yeah. You know, like that's another thing too. Oh. But you have to do that to yourself mentally, mm -hmm. in, in order to like you create a little short pneumatic so you remember correctly. You remember what you need but to do. But now you can go to the bed and heal up for free. Exactly. So, you know what? Also, I I tried to do what I tried to do was um with the help of uh some folks on Twitter figure out exactly how the hyper system works. Not in terms of turns, but in terms of how many you get to use before you can't do them anymore. Oh, okay. And the answer to that question is not on the internet. <laughs> oh, great. Is it in the guidebook? Uh, it's... I don't know. I don't have the guidebook. Me neither. <laughs> but from what... Everything I, I could... I, Wait, I'm, didn't you want to go to the store? Oh, the shops? Yes, yeah, for fire resistance. You're right. <laughs> Sorry, I, I just saved it's something. Okay. There. Okay. No, wait. Hold on. Oh, God, fuck. Even Why? more pressing matters. Even more pressing matters, Liam. Other things. Oh, the warriors. Hold on a minute. Skyroom. X and his goobers. We need to get up there. Because there's some shit that we did not do that needs doing. You need to change your scarf to green? I need to change my scarf to green, motherfucker. Okay, turn that shit up. Just, that's not worth it. That ain't worth it. I, I sincerely hope... I really hope there's like an emulation bug where green just doesn't work. Well, whatever the fuck. You talk your shit, talk mad shit. Okay, let's see here. Uh, it wasn't in that. It wasn't in that. It must be in this. Is this the, just a juke box? No. Alright. Is it this? Well... View data? Customize, customize. <laughs> customize. Why would you pick view data? Yo. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Fuck you. Yeah! A glue, cause we're boys. I come and back. <laughs> I come and back from my scarf. I'm so pleased by this. <laughs> I'm so happy. You fuck. I'm gonna come back when they have my colors. <laughs> You best believe it. God. You best believe it. God, I didn't think. Dude, I didn't think I could be so lucky. They put the function in the game. You think for a second I'm gonna ignore that shit? No, of course not. But you did before, so. I didn't know. Yeah, of course. Now I know. Now you know. Now you gotta go they, back. They got purple scarf, son. They got purple scarf. Oh, they scarf. have a purple one too? How, how many colors are there? Like I think, I think we got the Skittles rainbow. 
Is that that's the, a lot. I think that's what we got that's rocking with. You know, me and Matt recently played a game based on Skittles on the channel. I'm you, are you familiar this. with Dark and Sky? Oh my god. Is the Dude, name it's... of the official Skittles game Dark and Sky? Yeah, it is. That For the is, GameCube. That is insane. Dude, and no, I don't know anything about it. It is a fantasy action game. What? Shut up. It's awful. All right. All right, it's listen. so bad. Listen, listen. Liam, you lie sometimes. <laughs> Dude, it's a it's, and you're pretty good at it. I do it for your own benefit, but this is a fantasy action game where you play as a girl and you've got this like fucking gremlin who flies and follows around, follows you around, and you find this orange relic with a white S on it, and they're not sure what's up with it, and you got to go to this town and make this crossbow work. But that was where we stopped. It is so beyond trash. Dude, okay. It's real. It's super real. I can't, like... I, when the, when the video... You probably when, worked on it. When the video goes up, I will believe. It's been up, it's been up for months. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we don't seem to have, uh, fire protection, or fire guard, actually. Great, cool. Uh, can you make it with cinnamon, or...? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. That's that. I need to start. Also, this is the bad shop, isn't he? The bad shop. He's the general shop where he has uh, the not latest stuff. Yeah. No, it's the next one. Dun, 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 yeah. Dun, 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 I mean, I don't think he's expressly called bad shop, but no, I don't think so either. I don't think he appreciates it much, but you know, Aren't it's you... the reputation he has around here. Here Fire we guard. go. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Yep. Stock up. And uh, can you scroll over fire guard? I just wanted to read the exact description. Uh, fire value plus one level. Re okay, all right. And we want um, fire snuffing weapons, yes. so that means uh, water weapons, if possible. Um, what is this room? What is this room? I think that's the teleport room that she works with she to teleport you through? places. Yeah. Okay. Because that's a teleporter back there. Okay. So okay, equip that shit. Yeah, and then uh, we, these all have these requirements and shit that we. Yeah, need but to if you just scroll it. down, you can see if you can upgrade the fire ones or something. Upgrade? Um. Yeah. Is it even unlocked? Well, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, just mash down until until we see the word fire. Oh, uh, there's fire, fire guard. guard. Okay, yeah. No. Okay, so we're we're simply not there. All right. All right. So what we're gonna do is we're going to uh, equip. Yep. Our shit. Um. I gotta get rid of one of these weapon. Uh, energies. yeah, I, ditch I, ditch one of those two. Yeah, you, you're right. You gotta. I got. I want. You can ditch X heart if you want, but it's it's it's. I saved, know you like it. It but... saved us. It saved us once. Did it ever actually save us? Yeah. Well, or did it just revive Mega Man a couple times? It, it revived him a couple times. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I I want to get a weapon energy plus ten anyway. Uh, like, sure. Was what I should really be. Oh shit! I should just press the shoulder button. Yeah, yeah. Should be aiming for that. He's um, already got it on. You've got it on, and. Oh, uh, whatever. I'll give it to you because I want to use you a little bit. It's only protect one anyway, so. And then I think we have some extras. Yeah, we have one extra. And give uh, it to uh, Massimo, I guess. Because he's been rolling with the crew. Rolling, yeah. rolling with the God, crew. he still has slots that he doesn't have. I guess get rid of Eagle Eye. <laughs> and go back to missing every other slot. Eh. Yeah. Eh. So you know what the other thing is uh, that we just didn't understand? What's that? Was uh, C type and S type attacks? Yeah, shot and combat. I th oh, it's com. Okay, come on. I Shooting know. a gun is combat. I know. I know. Give me a break. I know. I wish I. I yeah, dude. I know. Sh shot types are for air enemies and combats for ground enemies, right? Ba well, basically, shot type works on either or, but combat will sometimes miss and will mostly miss on air enemies. On, yeah, on air I remember. Enemies. I remember reading that after the a couple episodes in. But and I, that's the deal. Is there anything else we want to buy right now? I don't think so. Uh, water, I mean, did water you type? want water weapons? Did yeah. you have water weapons? Yeah, we did not. Uh, uh, you're right. I'm walking back without even thinking about that because I'm talking at the same time. Uh, power charge is what I gave him. Hit, hit Z to organize this shit. Uh, attributes. Uh, yeah, there you go. Thunder, doesn't doesn't fire. look like it. And uh, I don't think the other guys had anything that was... No, no, they are equipping the same shit anyway. Well, it's so. up to you. If you want to go grab them, then they're well, they're right there. Having so. them is better than no. It's, not. it's super practical. I totally agree. And I got my blue scarf, so that means I'm all water themed. Yeah, no, it's cool. It's really cool. Blue's fine too. Blue's, Red, blue's red's okay. Blue's a good color. They're good. Mm, they're they're a boy. They're just they're just a little bit you know common is all. <laughs> just a little bit common. Green is like the second most common Ice. color in this game. Water attribute. There yeah. we go. 
Ooh, those are not cheap. Well, you got a lot of money, so... I wouldn't worry too much about it. Alright, there we go. And we can always say to sell and trade in. It's a baby RPG for kids, so... It is, yeah, but... There's still there's still things that we're not understanding about it, partially due to not paying attention at well, the time, not well, having a manual to read, not, not having... but not no exactly lack of explanation in some cases. But there is a help menu that we haven't sat and read through, so well, I'm no, not going to completely. We're not going to do that in the LP. That's not going to not going to blame it on that's the game stupid. for that. That's stupid. No, it's not the game's fault. Don't we just have we just haven't put enough time into it. Blame it on our stupidity. Hit Zeta. Yep. Where's my water at? Or rather, ice. Right at the top. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so I'm gonna give you an ice missile. Maybe. Yeah, no, that's fine. Um, Massimo. Yeah, you want to use Axel? That's for sure. Yeah, get rid of the thunder missile anyway. You don't fucking need it on Massimo. That's trash. And melt was good for the dropping. And the cracker, we never really. Got. That gives berserk effect, which is really good. And that one hits often. That ice. Yeah, I, I agree with that. And then she'll just do her thing. You, you, yeah, you steal absolutely. and you, you steal with accuracy. You steal accuracy. and that's it. But it's not quite accuracy because she missed that time. Yeah, that was weird. Yeah, and we got to end her kick. It counts as obviously combat, so it's not going to hit anything that's flying. Yes, yeah. Which The uh, kick on the on the uh, slot machine? Uh, yeah, exactly. So you need to remember okay. not to use that. That makes sense. Now, I'm assuming talking to our our girl whose only function is to be a CO yeah. is will send us right back to our save point. Yeah. Right? Right? I didn't even think about that. I'm assuming. Here, here is hoping. But honestly, yeah, I didn't even think about that. So Because video games can be mean if they want. Cro yeah, to. cross your fingers. This is going to be a long cut. You know? <laughs> Was that save point a bonfire? Even then, in some of the games, you can't, like, the bonfires are shittier. I always hated that in Bloodborne. That was, I think that was a flaw in Bloodborne. How you, you could only go. go to the Hunter's Dream from, from a lantern. And you couldn't, and you couldn't go to other bonfires. Mm. I thought that was actually a yeah. flaw with that yeah, game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the double load. Especially when it was a 45 second fucking load. It was unnecessary. Not great. Yeah. Begin mission. Yes. Sure hope you find zero. Please? No. Ah, uh, it's not gonna give it to you. Doesn't look good. It's not gonna give it oh to you. Oh my god, we're gonna have to run through that shit again. God damn it. Well... Yeah! Oh. Alright, time to cut. <laughs> Alright, that wasn't as bad as I thought. Uh, it was it was so fast to come back. It's nuts. Now that we actually, because like the map actually does kind of make sense. There's some shortcuts for how you can run back to where you were. Yeah. Um, Look, looking for 100 percent of the items really slows down that area a lot. Remember we went into that dead end to find the guy who we couldn't even pick up as well because we yeah. didn't have the ball and chain. And that, shit. Exactly. Like, we lost a lot of time there. So. Um, so I just made it so that my ice item like stopped that his flamethrower. By the way. Dope. So that's really good to know. Yeah. Um, is that guy fire element? I forget the little guy. I, I, th I think he's still here. I think I think both of these guys are, but I just can't remember at yeah. all. But uh, yeah, what I what's if you're gonna if you have save points and you're letting like you're letting players warp out of your areas, then you might as well make the save point like a tent at that point. Just like you know what I mean. Like you get to it, you heal up, everything's there. Because yeah, there's no real. Like, it's not like you're not going to heal yeah. up when they leave. I, I, uh, one of the games that I think did that well, and it was kind of like because there were no towns in the game, so for bullshit reasons, but, uh, Final Fantasy 13, every shop doubled as, or every save point doubled as a shop as well. Yeah. And your life, your life already restored to full between every battle, so that was irrelevant. But, um, having, having the shop on the save point really, yeah, really does save that kind of thing. Because it's true, right there, it was... It was needless, but I think a lot of RPGs of the era were like that, where they had that, like, waste of time kind of stuff. It, it just, I, I really dig it, it in it RPGs. It streamlines it, you know? Yeah, I, I really dig it in RPGs and stuff where, like, you explore an area enough, and then when you want to warp to that area, it's like, okay, which, which one in that area? And actually, we can go back to the Souls games and Bloodborne, because they right. do that great, where you're like... Oh, I don't have to go back to the beginning of Yarnum. I can, I can go, go to all of these different places. Save point to save point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Uh, and that's really practical. So it is, it is a shame they don't have that kind of thing. Here we go. Like, yes, it does take a little bit more work. Mm -hmm. Yes, it does. I mean, in some cases... It's, it's worth the effort. <laughs> in some cases, again, you have to use a tent item, and it's not like a free heal. 
yeah. you know, at a save point, but at least having it there just it just simplifies and saves time. It saves yeah. time, that's all. It's it's, it's tedium, it's cutting down exactly, on tedium. Exactly, when the game design accounts for grinding, because it's like, we're, it, let's be real, some players are going to be grinding. When you account for that, then you're, you're awesome. Yeah, um, definitely. Uh, 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 last Story, where it's like, here's your grinding room. Oh yeah, grinding rooms in the we're last just, story. We're not gonna I fucking forgot about those. Just infinite enemies, enjoy. Well, let's not pretend that everyone is is not doesn't want this. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, let's just be real about it. The RPG elements in that game were fucked though. Like, yeah, it like was perfect. Le levels, basically like, the stats you would gain from levels were so massive that all you had to make sure you did was be at roughly the same level as the enemies. And your weapons, like, who gives a shit about your weapons? It doesn't fucking matter. Right. Um, so, and the the experience cost to level up increased, like, exponentially. So you'd, you'd find a grinding area, and you'd stay at it until you weren't gaining a level rapidly. And that's it. Every time, it was really consistent. You'd do it, like, three or four times, and you'd be, like, soft-capped for that area. Because you'd have to do, like, ten more battles to get a single level. Isn't that effectively grinding, though, in the end? Like, isn't it the same um, basic thing? I mean, there's so in any it, other game. It that's depends. What the process is like. It depends on how the experience is, right? Because if you level up on a linear, cur uh, a linear, in a, li at a linear pace, then you can grind in an area more effectively, because the experience values of those enemies doesn't diminish as fast. On a on an exponential scale. Um, you start to need so much more experience between levels yeah. that the value of each enemy diminishes. So grinding in those kinds of games is borderline pointless. Okay. Because you're, like, you can go up, you know, say they're worth enough for you to effectively get to level 14 or 15, but then getting to level 16 would require you to fight 20 of them. And then level 17 re would require you to fight 50 of them. Right, you know, like, that's, right. that's stupid. Nobody's... I mean, the only people who are going to grind that are the people who, who want to see the maximum numbers on the screen, you know? How do you feel about games where the, the characters, or the, the enemies, level with you? I don't, I don't really like it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really like it that much. <laughs> like, where it, the challenge is always there, no matter yeah. what. There's no cap. I don't really dig it that much, because I, I kind of like, I kind of like in RPGs where you become powerful. Well, that's not going to work. <laughs> Where you become powerful and like you be, you, you're able to it? completely overwhelm. No, completely 100 percent, yeah. And you're able to overwhelm areas and stuff. Okay. Like, there's nothing quite like when you're playing Earthbound for the first time, and you realize that if you're a certain level above enemies, when you touch them on the world map, they'll die instantly, and you'll get your experience and money and stuff cashed out. Yeah, that's great. It's I love that. Awesome. It's so cool. And if they scale with you, you don't get that experience. Like. Granted, that's a very like unique to Earthbound thing. I mean, the, the, but, like, I'm sure the other part of that mentality is that you're going to be um, you're, the high level of el uh, abilities you have. Even if the enemies are stronger, you have like instant death spells and all kinds of crazy yeah. shit. Um, it's fun to just stomp enemies. Sometimes. Exactly. So it shouldn't be a problem. Yeah. Uh, Mad Nautilus did uh, thunder. I thought he was going to do water. So let me try Silverhorn again because I kind of forget. What... Silverhorn was the Rhino, which should be water. Okay, yeah, I wanted the big wave is what I was actually looking for. Yeah, I think this is the water guy. There we go. Yeah, Silverhorn is what we want. Good damage. <laughs> they fade back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like the waves push them and it's That's like, nice. oh. That's nice. You didn't push us at all. That looks silly. Yeah. Um, I think game, uh, some of the games that did it best in, in um, modern times anyway are like The World Ends With You and Bravely Default. Okay. Um, where you can... Uh, dynamically and on the fly adjust like the rate that you'll encounter battles at and stuff like that. The world ends with you in particular is the best one where you can just turn off random battles uh, by not grabbing enemies. Like you just don't have to fight enemies if you don't want to. And you can turn up and down the difficulty of the fights in the world ends with you in like in the menu at any time. Oh, and yeah, that was a thing, wasn't it? Yeah, and yeah. it was fantastic. The higher difficulty, the more rewards you would get from finishing a battle. So, like, each enemy had a different drop for each difficulty, each of the four difficulties. Um, and you could only get those drops by being on that difficulty and fighting those enemies. And, and like, the world ends with you is crazy, because, like, say there's, like, six enemies on the screen, right? 
you got to pick which ones you fought. You didn't ha they didn't like attack you or anything. So you could put the difficulty or you could pick a bunch of enemies and you'd fight all those battles in a row, one at a time. Um and you'd have a chance of getting their drops, but the more enemies you chose to fight at the same time, the more chances you'd get of getting those drops. Right. Like if you did six battles, it would multiply the drop rates by six. Yeah, I remember on that. On top of right, all the other that. It's like, such an amazing game. Yeah, I, like it's that incredible. That's, mechanically that stuff is cool. That it's cool that that was there, but you know, I you have to stay fashionable too. I just I couldn't in the end. I couldn't. It's hard. It's a it's a tough game to get over that learning curve. But, but it, 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 I was also like I wasn't having fun with the combat, like because of the the the, the ADD nature of switching back and forth. But look, man, a lot more people love it than don't love it. So yeah, I'm not or you know as far as people that know that it even exists. So I'm not gonna like sit here and harp. I have my feelings on the matter, and that's yeah, it, no, you know? I hear ya. It's coming up on its 10th anniversary soon. soon I would love, I would love, like, that world to be revisited. I wish, like, there was that teaser for a new game. Yeah. Or, or teaser for something, right? There's been a couple uh, soundtrack CDs released um, between then and now, and those soundtracks are amazing. Like, the remix soundtracks, they're incredible. Uh, because that is, it's it's absolutely my, that's my aesthetic, man. I'm super on board with it's, that. It's that the style, best. I, I'm surprised you haven't tried to play it again, honestly, because it's it's just there's nothing like it. It's seriously the best game Square Enix has ever made. Like I, I meant, fuck Chrono Trigger. Like, <laughs> oh wow. But but wow. even if even if you have to go there, wow. Even if you disagree with that, I yeah. would challenge that it's the best game they made since Chrono Trigger. I, like I, 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 I meant to try out the phone version. Uh, when right. That was yeah. Happening, so you have a single screen. Yeah. Not just because it's on a phone, because obviously, like, I don't really care for that. It's, it's a really good version of the game. But I, I, you know, I'm curious to see how a single screen L, uh, version of it plays. Yeah. It, it worked just fine. It was like you lost the second screen element, obviously. So the the partners just became like a little tag in assist kind of thing. Yeah. So that was. It's a bit lame losing that element. But as far as getting the experience across, you'll get most of it playing that version. Uh, so these items, Gain Hyper, do what the bed does. They give you back your hyper uses. Oh, okay, yeah. But there's... I can't seem to... It, it, there doesn't seem to be any place where it indicates how many hyper uses you have. Maybe I'm just, like, um, not looking at something. Uh, seven? Yeah. Is that the count? Wait, where, where does it even say? Oh, hyper the, five. Yeah, it says that, right at the top. But yeah. those are not turns. That's turns. Those I are think. turns, though. Because I think that's hyper turns, two. That's he only had two, two turns, turns of invincibility. Yeah, these are turns. What I want to know is like uses of hyper is what I want. Well, to it, know. you can probably use it as long as you have turns. Then you know but what I, I mean. But but every like time if you I've, finish a battle prematurely. I no, but I've never. Uh, uh, hold on, I've never not used it for every turn. Like I've kept it on until. Yeah. Exactly. That's it, what I'm saying. Like, wore off. what if you what if you used it in battle and then only had one more turn in the battle and then ended it? You know what I mean? But but it, or can you end it yourself? You can end it yourself. Yeah, so. and preserve that turn. But it doesn't tell you because remember the point where I got to a battle and I had no, I couldn't use hyper at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that means that like there's an actual limit besides the turns. It's not like you get. Yeah, I mean, it might just be the turns. But it's not six turns per battle, and it's not six turns total. No. So it's, it's something else. But it might yeah. just be the turns. We don't really have enough info right now. So you want to just charge. <laughs> uh, or defend. Or guard. Guard. Yeah, that's true. Guard. Someone said that I should put the Z button to hyper mode because that would come in more handy. But uh... Uh, what is the Z button now? D block. Yeah, I mean, they're both they're both good. <laughs> um, Guess keep blocking. <laughs> yeah. I mean, they're just gonna do a bunch of damage, and any any attack on them, you're gonna eat what was it, 400 damage or some bullshit? So, yeah, it would have been really good damage if he didn't block. Yeah. So uh, Massimo can start attacking now. But so he can. Uh, he'll. I'll, I'll let him attack solo on this guy. Kaboom! Good voice acting. <laughs> that was a good line. Kaboom! Can you read it again? No. I won't do it. Oh, luckily they didn't attack Massimo. Yeah, there. that is good. Okay. Now, uh, Axel can do your... Or, or, no, wait, these guys are not fire enemies. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're uh, totally neutral. They're just neutral. All right, well then... Just wail on them. Yeah, let's do your... Uh, let's do one of these. No, you got to target the right one. Okay. Oh, yeah, well, this does... This attacks all of them anyway. Well, so. Tango. 
Sure. While Django was the neutral damage. I believe it yeah. was. No, that's not neutral at all. Wait, that's super neutral. That's why it did super effective damage. I no, don't know. that looked like thunder to me. There's a giant thunder strike. Yeah, no, it's I know. Probably but it did thunder. super effective damage, but they're not <laughs> thunder elements, so I'm wondering what that is. Or lightning element, rather. Thunder's, a, thunder's audio. I always get those two mixed yeah, up. Yeah, well, but, but you know what Pokemon like. has conditioned me that Thunder is like a really strong lightning bolt. <laughs> yes, but you're, yes, Thunder is the audio, lightning yeah. is the, the actual bolt. bolt. The danger bolt. All right. Well, I guess I know who I'm attacking now. <laughs> Kaboom. This is nothing. Wow, yeah, that's it's a lot of damage. It's crazy, dude. It's so much. Massimo is, yeah, shit. I guess killed B3 at least. Yeah. Holy fuck, man. That's a, no, it's a ton of damage, dude. Like no two ways around it. That blocking is definitely worthwhile. Taking less than 300, that's literally like 50%. Yeah, I, want, I, I just need these fuckers dead. Uh, Massimo. Uh, this should kill. This should kill. It could, yeah. Oh, you didn't do this. Okay. This should kill. Absolutely. And if it doesn't, then something's wrong. But, uh, and then we'll just do a heal on them. Nice. Okay, time to fucking guard. And or or dead. we'll heal. You know what? X will, X will heal them. These yeah. guys will guard. Sure. That makes sense. Uh, I say you want. Oh, what are you using? I'm using 50 on all. How much does 50 on all cost? 80? Uh, Unless... Because if I do solos... Because just do, just do max on Massimo. And... 60 and then... And 25 on Axel. It's better than 50 on all. Because 50 on Mega Man is wasted. And Massimo having his full 2,000 something is like a lot more valuable than like Mega Man being at 17, like getting a tiny boost. Fucking block Axel. Oh my god. Perfect. <laughs> that was fine though. Yeah, I would have rocked this shit. Uh, and then everybody kill this guy. Kill this guy hard. Charge shot. I wish all the damage would go to the. Like, I wish the damage would be concentrated or split. When you mean when uh, on, when you use the charge shot, depending the charge on the enemy shot. groupings, yeah, yeah, that'd be nice. Honestly, it just looks stupid the way it spreads out like that. I had forgotten that it spread out. It's an it's an all attack. This move is still cool. Yeah, and it's going to be. We never tried failing it, by the way. What happens when you? I don't fail know. It, like... I don't know. But it feels like it's going to be the best thing in the game. <laughs> like so, so when far, you yeah, beat absolutely. more bosses. Because it's, dude, it's any element you want. Yeah, right now it's a, like a complete Off stomp. Off the fucking cuff, you know? And it's easy. It's not like uh, the, the, the two roulette characters where you can fuck it up all the time. And it doesn't use hyper. Like, what did you just get there? Ah, oh, shit, you're right. I paused it before looking. Weapon energy. Nice. Um, Still, you're going to have to heal Axel as well. Yeah. It doesn't use... No, more than that. Because you took a little bit more damage. It doesn't use your hyper meter, and that's key. That's fucking great. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, this team is still fine. And then the exit. Nothing that way. Don't go that way. Uh, There's nothing that way. That leads you to the exit. You want to go that way. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Right. yeah, we do it again. Conveyor puzzle room. That's fine. That's fine. These things aren't particularly troublesome or anything. Oh, no. Too late. Well, Too late. Okay. Uh, let's see. No, only one way to go. Aw, oh, I have to go the long way. Yeah, that's fine. Oh. Honestly, you probably have to do all of it if you want to get all the items anyway, so... There surely must be an optimized for way. Surely. We're not going to find that way. We're going to make our own path. With these two hands. God, fuck these enemies. They're I know. So, like, because now do you wail on the middle guy or yeah, do you yeah, just yeah, until they're done. I'm gonna play it safe. Yeah. Because <laughs> otherwise, oh when everyone God. isn't doing it, it fucks up the whole the plan. 
Because he's still going to do damage. He's getting good hits in. Decent hits. Is there a way to get them out of that? Like, that's what I'm wondering. Uh, unless, it, like, unless it's a type of shot. Like, if we have to do, um... No, no, no. It seemed like it's no matter what we attack them with, they just did it. But mm -hmm. I, I don't know. I don't know. Because if there's no counter to it, then, like... It's just tough. It's just hard to deal <laughs> with. Maybe, maybe it's a certain, maybe it's an S type shot that you need to do, or you, or a C type shot. Yeah, that that, that's do. exactly what I'm thinking, but I have no idea. We can take the risk next time there's one of them alive. Okay, we'll pick one and murder it. Yeah, well, I want him dead, so I'm gonna kill him. Um. Ha! Oh my God, this charges up so fast. It's great. It's great. He starts. He starts at 74 yeah. right there too. Like. At one point, like not here, because this area is. You know, actually fail threatening. It. But at one point, you gotta fail it. I wanna see what happens. If there's just some weak attack that comes out still. Maybe it just picks a random one. I wanna see if he does a cool dive kick. Or something. It'd be interesting to see if there, he does a weak, like, a, just a, he picks a random one so you get the benefits anyway, but you just don't choose which one you. That'd be too good. You know? Yeah. I um, know. yeah. I don't know. I'll just make sure you kill this guy. He's really resilient. He didn't take a ton of damage from that. Having that weapon energy up is really useful too. Oh my god, now that's so weak. Unfortunately, but like he he get, he was way closer to max than fifty there. Mm -hmm. And then I'll just burn this on you as well. Behold, my true power. You know, I should have been killing the guys that have the shields. Yeah, I mean, I questioned it, but then I went I first for the middle guy. Loud. I went first for the middle guy because he wasn't blocking, but because they're gonna do their thing again, it's gonna be trouble. Here you go. Okay, hold on a second. I read that shield is for countering shots, and armor is for countering uh, combat. Okay. So maybe combat. Well, you can try it. Hacks will work. Uh, Axel probably can't even take a blocked one though, so he just needs to heal right now. Yeah. Uh, Sixty for a max. Why not? Uh This is nothing. No. I'm not gonna find out now. Yeah, heal Mega Man Max. <sighs> Someone's gotta do it. Yeah. Axel no. there, you should have healed him fifty percent by the way. Cause he had eight hundred, so he would have went up to sixteen hundred ish. Cause it's fifty percent of their maximum. Yeah. So. Yeah. Uh okay, so Let's see. Kill B1. B1's the weakest. It was the one you picked. It's the don't, one I... Don't no, split, no, your, you don't split yeah. your focus. That's no, 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 no. I know. I, what, I'm, what I'm trying to think of is who has a... Um, who has a C attack amongst this group or if I have to switch someone in to do one. Yeah, well, Massimo clearly does, but... Okay. His well, hammer must be. Uh, should I action trigger? I'll action trigger again. But doesn't it do a lot more damage when it's at 100, dude? Like, isn't yeah. that the way it works? It's supposed to. I got I got 1,500 off of, like, 70-something, though, so that's still pretty good. Like, I'll take that. That was 50%, right? Yeah, it was 50%. Yeah. Did 1,100 damage. I'll, t I'll fucking take that. Uh, okay, so... Uh, well, you know what? I'll just... Yeah, I'll just... Hyper on you. Nothing. Stop wasting time with these fucking shitty enemies. Yeah, they kind of suck. Unless we have the card counter in mind. Because if we're wrong about that, then it's and they're actually what we think they are, which is just block. Well, I, I sincerely hope so, honestly. Because you can, when he does it next, just try attacking with a melee attack, and we'll we'll find out pretty quick. So should, should I waste a turn here to just find out? No, I mean kill him. You know, don't. Okay. But you know, next time we see some. Oh, he's actually gonna get a chance. No, he's not. Well. Yeah, you should unhyper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. Yeah, I, I just realized that. Uh, cool down.
That actually makes um, spiders even more practical. If you can turn it off and on, then you can specifically be like, invincible oh, next turn now. I need to be invincible. But it's only if you think he's going to get uh, attacked, right? Yeah, but if like the enemy's got like a wide range attack or something, you know? Cinnamon got an action trigger. That's good. She's getting there. She's level 12. You said 13 is one we you want to try? You think she's yeah, but now she's out? even further back because we're 17 now. So. <laughs> well, well, guess how but, guess how age works. No, right? no, but that, it, it doesn't work like age because it's not a linear equation. It's it's, it's exponential. She's, she's eventually, she eventually, she eventually going to get up. a little yes. bit closer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like she's not going to get all the way for a long, long, long time. But even age is kind of like that because away. at a certain point after what? like 20? No, age is linear. Age, you, you can't catch but, up. <laughs> but no, but, but what I mean is after like 25. you got to be on the moon for after change. 25, no one cares. No, yeah, okay, no one cares. You yeah, know? Sure. It almost doesn't even matter. Yeah.